ይነሳ ያንተ ነገር አይሰካም ህይወታችሁ በጠቅላላ በደጆች የተሞላ ለነገሳት ንጉስ ሰግዳለሁ ወደ ከፍታ ይመልሰኛል አላሜ አላቅ ለመሆን አይ ያስፈ such a wonderful prophetical anointing in this meeting bezi sibsabachin lay degmo betam talak yihona dink yihona timbitawi sifra no i will quote three scriptures from the epistle to the hebrews which make three very powerful statement ka ibrawian mezaf lay 3 wanna wanna fre neger yayazen neger etekasallo zare and i will start to read from hebrews 9 and verse 22 ibrawian miraf 9 quter 22 lay ejemralaw we vow shedding of blood there is no remission demem saifes sirret yellem ilal hebrew 11 and verse 6 ibrawian 11 6 tnawatallen but without faith it is impossible to please god yale emnetim des masenyet aichalem ilal And Hebrews 12 verse 14. Ibrawian 12 quter 14 lay degmo without holiness no one will see God. Yale irsu getan liya yemichil yellemna ilal. Yale qiddisna egziaberen mayet yemichil yellem. Three powerful statement. Enezi 3 hayal yihonu fre neger yayazu arafte negeroch nacho. Without the blood there is no remission. Dem kemefses wuci sirret yellem. Without faith No one can please God. Yale emnet egziaber endes masenyet aichalem. Without holiness no one will see God. Yale qiddisna mannem egziaberen mayet aichalem. You know life is in the blood. Tawqallachu hiywet yemigenyaw dem ust no. The blood circulate in the body. Dem besawnetachin ust hullu yitalalafal. It brings healing to the body. Wede sawnetachin degmo fawsin yamatsal. it attack the infection and it defeat it besawnetachin ust degmo and etemerezen neger kalle yannen yatakawal in your blood you have the white blood cells and you have the red blood cells bedemachin ust nech edem selna qey edem sel mi balalle but a serious blood disease can nullify the entire immune system የደም ደም በሽታ ወይ የደም ችግር ያለበት ሰው ላይ ደግሞ እነዚህ የደም ሁኔታዎችን ሁሉ እንዳይሰሩ ያደርጋቸዋል It happened to a young friend of me የኔ ደግሞ አንድ ወጣት የሆነ ጓደኛዬ ላይ እንደዚህ ሆነበታል He came to one of our best hospital in Sweden በስዊድን ውስጥ ምርጥ ወደም ይባለው ሆስፒታል ሄዶ ነበር He had a blood poison ከዛም ደም ተመርዟል አሉት and the doctor tried everything they could to save his life hakimochum hiwetun lamadan bizu neger mokkeru but he had almost no white blood cells neger gin nech edem selu bemulu aliqo nebere so an ordinary disease which most people will survive without problem selezi bizu sewoch degmo bizu beshita siizacho took his life in one of our best hospitals wede mirt wede mibal hospital no mihedut because his immune system was defected mekniyatum degmo demu sile tammeme nebere you know yes before i came here to ethiopia wede etiopia kememtat yem befit this year i turned to be 69 years of age bezi amet 69 amet imolanyal My dear friends I'm a very old man. Weda jochehu betam shumagilenenyine. Ah you look surprised. Betam tedenaqachu aden. You didn't thought I was that old. Menalbat wotatno bilachu asabachu liyon ichilal. But this year I turned to be 69. Neger gin bezi amet 69 amet imolanyal. God has blessed me with a good health. Egziaber gin betam melkam bemibal tenenet barkonyal. I'm almost never sick. መቼም ታመም ያላውቅ ነበር It's grace from God ከእግዚአብሔር የሆነ ጸጋ ስላለኝ And this year is also a jubilee year for me ደግሞ ይ አመትም እንደዛው ነበር It's a golden jubilee በየወርቅ ይበልዩ ነበር Because my wife and me we have been married 
50 years in October. Mekniyatum ene na balabete October lai hamsa amet kagabba katagabban hamsa metanya chinnabere. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So it's a year of jubilee. Selazi yawark a jubilee ya chinnabere. But two weeks, three weeks ago. Nager kin kahulat na kaso samenta. I got Befit. an infection in my body. I went to the dentist. And the dentist they could see by an x-ray that I had a blood, I had a, a dangerous infection in the mouth. And I had it for some time. And it could not go away. So the dentist pulled out the teeth for me. He said I was the only way to cure the blood disease, the infection. But infection exploded in my body. My face got swollen. And I became very sick and bad. And I fight it day by day. And I was almost wondering, it was like the enemy said to me, you cannot go to Ethiopia. I was thinking, shall I write the WhatsApp to the rest? And say we have to postpone my visit. But many people prayed for me all over the world. And then I went to the doctor. And I said, I want you to test my blood. And the doctor tested me. He saw the infection. But the infection on Ayo. And he saw the numbers. But he said one thing to me. I tell you one thing, Yoran. You have very healthy blood. But I'm telling you, Yohana Dem, Allah Haling. Your white blood cells. Not your dem cells. And your red blood cells. The mum ayu your dem cells. They are very powerful. But I'm behind it, I'm on Luna Chow. Don't be scared for the infection. So let the infection on and that Pharaoh. Your white blood cells. Not your dem cells. Are the soldiers of your body. Yes, how in that what that derroch na chawale? They are attacking the infection. Infection on yet a kuti ganyalo. And they will defeat the infection. Degmo mi an infection ya shan futal. And I tell you today. Selezi zare menagra chawale. They have defeated the infection. Infection on a shan futal. And I feel very healthy and very strong. Bet am te ne nyane ni bet am bertune. Because God was installing this healing system in the body. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The doctor said you have very strong blood. But I want to tell every one of you here this morning. Are you listening to me? The day you became born again. The day you gave your life to Jesus of Nazareth. His powerful blood. Purifies your nature. And fight the infection. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. By his blood. Bedamu. There is power. Bedamu is high. And it will attack the enemy. Wow. Amen. Amen. You know, God has laid a healing system in the body. But there are something we should be very careful about. It was a friend of me in Sweden. He got an infection in his eye. But he could not stop scratching the eye. Many times with dirty fingers, 
He was scratching the eye. ብዙ ጊዜ ደግሞ በቆሻሻ እጁ ነው አይኑን የሚያሸው And he increased the infection. ከዛ ያንን ኢንፌክሽን ጨመረበት And the only way to save his life. ህይወቱን ደግሞ ማዳን የሚቻለው was to pluck out his eye. አይኑን በማውጣት ብቻ ነበረ I want to tell you something. ነገር ግን አንድ ነገር ልንገራችሁ Let the blood of Jesus do the work in you. በእናንተ ላይ የኢየሱስ ደም እንዲሰራ ፍቀዱለት And don't scratch with dirty fingers. በቆሻሻ ጃችሁም አትሹ You might increase the problem. ችግራችሁን ልታብሱት ትችላላችሁ But come in the presence of Jesus. ነገር ግን ወደ ኢየሱስ ህልውና ኑ Live your life in the presence of Jesus. ሕይወታችሁን በኢየሱስ ህልውና ውስጥ ኑሩ And let his blood do the miraculous work in your life. በሕይወታችሁ ላይ ደግሞ ኢየሱ የተወደደው ደም ደግሞ ተአምራትን እንዲያደርግ አድርጉ Somebody lift your hand and say hallelujah. እጃችሁን ከፍ አድርጉና ሃሌሉያ በሉስቲ The blood is precious, precious and important for life. የኢየሱስ ደም በሕይወታችን ላይ ደግሞ በጣም አስፈላጊ ነው In the book of Exodus chapter 12 we can read about the Israelites having their exodus from Egypt. በዘጻት መጽሐፍ ምዕራፍ 12 ላይ ስናነብ ደግሞ እንዴት ደሙን እንደሚጠቀሙ እናያለን? God was about to execute judgment over Egypt. ከኢጅፕቶያውያን እንደግሞ ሊያስወጣ ፈልጎ ነበር እግዚአብሔር But God wanted to save the Israelites. እግዚአብሔር ግን እስራኤላውያኖች እንደግሞ ማዳን ፈልጎ ነበር So he told them to slaughter a spotless lamb. ስለዚህ ደግሞ እንደዚህ ብሎ ነገራቸው ጠቦት የሆነን በግ ረዱ አላቸው and put that blood upon the doorpost yanen dem demo wusedu na meqanachu we begubenu lay qabu alachaw for protection and tetebequ and the night when god sent the angel of destruction kaza degmo bema bemishitim degmo egziaber andin melak betezazlakaw the angel of destruction was entering every home in egypt begibs yemigenyutin beyandandu bet degmo ya melak megbat jemere and brought death tears agony and sorrow kaza degmo lenaza le gibtsawian hullu hazen metabacho but the angel of destruction neger gin ya yetfat yihono melak could never enter the household of the israelites wede israelianoch bet ligaba alchalem do you know why lemen endona tawqallachu because the blood of the lamb ከበጉ ደም የተነሳ ነው and the blood of the lamb ከያ የዛ ጠቦት ደም brought redemption to the israelites ለእስራኤላውያኖች ደግሞ መዋጀት አመጣላቸው the slavery was stopped because of the blood ከደሙ የተነሳ ባርነት አበቃ even sickness were healed that night because of the blood ከደሙ የተነሳ በዛ ምሽት የታመሙ እንኳን መፈውስ ጀመሩ among the israelites there were many sick people በእስራኤልን መካከር ደግሞ ብዙ የታመሙ ሰዎች ነበሩ they had been working as slaves እንደ ባሪያ ነበር ሲሰሩ የነበረው ill treated ያል ተማሩ ነበሩ all kind of sickness ብዙ አይነት በሽታም ነበረባቸው they were blind they were deaf ደግሞ ብዙ ውሮች ብዙ ደግሞ መስማት የማይችሉም ነበሩ they were crippled they were dumb ብዙ ሽባዎች ነበሩ የታመሙ ሰዎች ነበሩ at that night when they were eating the slaughtered lamb ነገር ግን በዛ ምሽት ያንን የበጉን ደም በቤታቸው ላይ ከቀቡ በኋላ that night when the blood was on the door post በበራቸው በጉበናቸው ላይ ያንን ደም ከቀቡ በኋላ that was released a mass miracle ታላቅ የሆነ ደግሞ ተአምራት ተለቀቀላቸው the whole people of israel yisraelan betaklalla during that night bezamishit experience the mass miracle talak yihonen ta'amrat wesedu and i want to tell you selezi zare menegrachawallo this was still in the old testament ye bebelu kidan lay nebere it was only pointing toward the coming of jesus christ ye degmo mulket yemiyasayen sele christos yesus memtat nebere and still it was such a power in the blood of the lamb ደግሞ በበጉ ደም ላይ ያለውን ኃይል ነበር ያስረዳን I want to tell you this morning ዛሬ ማለዳ ልንገራችሁ My dear friends in Bishofto በቢሾፍቱ የምትገኙ ወዳጆች ይሆን There is power in the blood of the lamb በበጉ ደም ላይ ኃይል አለ The curse is broken 
ደግሞ እርግማን ተሰብሯል the sickness is broken በሽታ ተሰብሯል the demons has to flee ደግሞ አጋንን ትለቀው ሞታት አለባቸው financial miracles will come የገንዘብ ተአምራት ይመጣል because it's time of god's redemption ምክንያቱም የእግዚአብሔር የሥርየት ጊዜ ነው hallelujah hallelujah the power in the blood በደሙ ላይ ያለ ኃይል in leviticus chapter 16 we read about the day of atonement ዘለዋውያን ምራፍ 16 ላይ አንድ ነገር እናነባለን The Bible tells us that once a year the high priest came into the most holy of holiness መጻፍ ቅዱስ ሲናገር ደግሞ በአመት አንድ ጊዜ በዚህ ጊዜ ላይ ደግሞ ሊቀ ካህኑ ወደ ቅድሰ ቅዱሳናት ደግሞ ደምን ይዞ ይገባል And he never came without blood በደም ይዞ ነው የሚገባው He came with blood of a bull or a ram ደግሞ ያንድን የተሰዋ በግ ይዞ ነው የሚገባው And on that day he brought redemption and forgiveness for the whole nation of Israel ለክያንን ትኩስ ደም ይዞ ደግሞ ወደ ቅድሰ ቅዱሳን ሲገባ ለእስራኤል ሁሉ የኃጢአት ስርየት ይሆንላቸዋል But this offering was prophetically pointing towards the coming of Jesus Christ ይሄ ደግሞ ምሳሌያዊ የሚናገረው የሥለ ክርስቶስ ኢየሱስ መምጣት እንደ ትንቢት ነው የሚናገረው when Jesus came John the Baptist said ከዛ ኢየሱስ ደግሞ መጣ መጥምቆ ዮሐንስ እንደተናገረው behold the lamb of god who take away the sins of the world እነሆ ያለመን ሁሉ ኃጢአት የሚወስድ የእግዚአብሔር በጋለው hallelujah hallelujah jesus is the perfect lamb of god ኢየሱስ የእግዚአብሔር በግ ነው ፍጹም የሆነው የእግዚአብሔር በግ ነው and it is by the blood of jesus we are both free from slavery ከባርነት ደግሞ ነጻ የወጣ ነው በዚህ በበጉ ደም በክርስቶስ ኢየሱስ ደም የተነሳ ነው The Bible says መጽሐፍ ቅዱስ ሲናገር that it was by the precious blood of Jesus Christ በዚህ ውድ በሆነው በክርስቶስ ኢየሱስ ደም ነው የነጻ ነው The lamb without blemish or defect ደግሞ ካለ ነቀፋ እንድንሆን የተደረገ ነው He was chosen before the creation of the world ዓለም ሳይፈጠር ገና ደግሞ የተመረጠ ነበር Hallelujah Hallelujah You know when we come to heaven ታውቃላችሁ there will be a song which we will hear in heaven and we will sing with them in that song wede samay degmo sinehed kemalakt gar yeminezemero and zemari alle wordy wordy is the lamb yebegu degmo ihe misganachin yigebawal no yegziaber begi ihe misganachin yigebawal who have redeemed us to god kegziaber gar yastarekene by your blood bedeme out of every tribe tongue people and nation degmom ketinyom israt ketinyom tefetro irgmane and made us king and priest to god wetten degmo legziaber hulachinim negestatna kahanat adaregen hallelujah hallelujah because of the blood of jesus ke yesus dem yetenesano we preach the blood gospel selezi yeminnesebko degmo ye demun melekt weim sibket no We preach the gospel of Jesus Christ the victory on Calvary where he shed his blood for our redemption. ለሃጢያታችን እና ስለሃጢያታችን ስርየት ደግሞ በቃራኔው መስቀል ላይ ደሙን ስላፈሰሰው ስለ ክርስቶስ ኢየሱስ እንሰብካለን. And it says in first epistle to John. ከዛም አንደኛው ዮሐንስ ላይ ሲናገር እንደዚህ አለ. Chapter 1 verse 7 አንድ ሰባት ላይ አንደኛ ዮሐንስ 1 ሰባት If we walk in the light mm-hmm. as he is in the light we have fellowship with one another and the blood of Jesus Christ cleanses us from all our sins አንደኛ ዮሐንስ ምዕራፍ 1 ቁጥር 7 እንደዚህ ይላል ነገር ግን እርሱ በብርሃን እንዳለ በብርሃን ብንመላለስ ለእያንዳንዳችን ህብረት አለን የልጁም የኢየሱስ ክርስቶስ ደም ከኃጢአት ሁሉ ያነጻል ይላል You see that there is still one condition. ነገር ግን አንድ ሁኔታ አለ If we walk in the light. በብርሃን ብንመላለስ ነው ይላል You know Jesus said the light has come to the world and the darkness has no power over it. ኢየሱስ ሲናገር ደግሞ እንደዚህ ያለ ብርሃን ወደ ዓለም መጣ ስለዚህ ጨለማም ፍጹሞ አይቋቋመው ማለት It means the light is more powerful than the darkness. ያ ማለት ደግሞ ከጨለማ የበለጸ ብርሃን ኃይል አለው ማለት ነው. If we turn on the light the darkness disappear. ልክ ብርሃን ስታበሩ ጨለማ ለቆ ይሄዳል. But no the bible says 
for a Christian if we walk in the light. መጻፍ ቅዱስ ሲናገር እኛ ክርስቲያኖች በብርሃን ብንመላለስ ነው የሚለው But every time when the devil is tempting you to be a backslider ነገር ግን ሁሉ ጊዜ ዲያብሎስ እናንተን ይፈትናቸዋል ወደ ኋላ እንድትመለሱ ያደርጋቸዋል He want you to do things in secret በሚስጥር ደግሞ ነገሮችን እንድታደርጉ ይፈልጋል And then you keep on doing things in secret. በሚስጥር አድርጋችሁ ደግሞ አንድ አንድ ነገሮችን ታደርጋላችሁ He catch you. ከዛም ይዛቸዋል Because that is in that secret you come into darkness. ምክንያቱም ያ ሚስጥር ማድረግ ስትጀምር ወደ ጨለማ ሄዳችሁ ማለት ነው You may come to the church and you may show hallelujah. ምናልባትም ወደ ቤተክርስቲያን መጣችሁ ሃሌሉያ ብላችሁ ልትጮሁት ይችላልላችሁ But there are some rooms in your life which you don't want to expose. ነገር ግን አንድ አንድ የሰውነታችሁ ላይ ያስቀመጣችሁት ነገር አለ ማሳየት የማትፈልጉት. Those rooms there are dirtiness. ምናልባትም አንድ ቆሻሻ ነገር. There are bad things. መጥፎ ነገር. And that is the reason why Satan can have his hand and hold on you. ለዛ ነው ሰይጣን ደግሞ ጆቹን በእናንተ ላይ መጫን የሚችለው But the Bible says ነገር ግን መጽሐፍ ቅዱስ ሲናገር If we confess our sins ሀጢያታችንን በእናዘዝ ይላል He is faithful and just to us ደግሞ የለኛ ይቅር ሊለን እርሱ ጻድቅ ነው And he forgive us our sins ሀጢያታችንን ሁሉ ይቅር ይለናል And cleanse us from all unrighteousness ደግሞ ያለጻው ነገር ሁሉ ያነጻል Hallelujah Hallelujah If we walk in the light በብርሃን የምንመለስ ከሆነ He is in the light እርሱ በብርሃን እንዳለው We have fellowship one with another እንደዛው ደግሞ እርስ በራሳችን ህብረትም አለን And the blood of Jesus የኢየሱስ ደም cleanse us ያነጻናል purify us ያጸዳናል goes through your whole body በደሰውነታችሁ ሁሉ ይሄዳል በህልማችሁ ሊሆን ይችላል በሐሳባችሁ ሊሆን ይችላል it cleans you ያነጻችኋል and satan has no hold on you satan እናንተን ማያዝ መቆጣጠር አይችልም i want you today ስለዚህ ዛሬ as you stand in front of jesus በኢየሱስ ፊት መጣችሁ ስትቆሙ you expose all the rooms in your life to jesus በይወታችሁ ላይ ያለውን ነገር ሁሉ ለኢየሱስ ገልጣችሁ አሳዩት if there is any secret room በውስጣችሁ አንደኛ ሚስጥር ነገር ካለ ወይም ቆሻሻ ነገር ካለ ምናልባት ፓስተራችሁ ላይ አውቀው ይችላል ነገር ግን ስለዛ ኢየሱስ እንገሩት በዛ ክፍል ውስጥ ደግሞ ብርሃን እንዲወርድ ፍቀዱለት ከዛም ደግሞ ደሙ ያነጻችኋል ሀጢያታችሁንም ደግሞ አጥቦ ያስወግዳል ከዛም ነጻት ወጣላችሁ በኢየሱስ ስም ሃሌሉያ ሃሌሉያ አይ ቢሊቭ देयर आर सम थिंग्स वी हैव टू डू አንድ ማድረግ ያለብን ነገር እንዳለ አስባለሁ ሀጢያታችንን መናዘዝ አለብን we need to show regretting in front of god kazam begziaber fit honen lin tsetset igabanal and we need to convert kazam meqer allebin because we shall not sin upon the grace mekniyatun betsegaw lay hatiyat lin sera aygabaw because our god is a god of holiness mekniyatun amlakachin qiddus yihone amlak no hallelujah hallelujah glory be to god kibir legziaber yihon You know God is very much ready to forgive us. ታውቃላችሁ እግዚአብሔር ሁላችንን ይቅር ሊለን ዝግጁ ነው. In fact it says in 2 Corinthians chapter 5. ሁለተኛ ቆሮንቶስ ምዕራፍ 5 ላይ ሲናገር እንደዚህ ይላል. That he has already forgiven us. ሁላችንንም ይቅር ብሎናል. Even all our debts he has he has crucified he has nailed them to the cross. እዳችንንም ደግሞ ከመስቀሉ ጋር አብሮ ጠርቆታል። And the gift of grace is free. የጸጋም ስጦታ ለኛ ነጻ ነው but we have to confess it and then his blood is purifying us from it ነገር ግን መጀመሪያ ሀጢያታችንን ለነናዘዝ ይገባል ከዛ ደግሞ ደሙ ያጽበናል i told a little story when we were in diridaba በድሬዳ ያለን አንድን ታሪክ ተናገርኩኝ we had a very good brother in our mission office በተልኮ ቢሯችን ውስጥ አንድ ምን ወደ ወዳጃችን ነበር he had been a drug addict 
ደግሞ የአሽሽ ሱሰኛ ነበረ ያልኮልም ሱሰኛ ነበረ እግዚአብሔር ግን በህይወቱ ላይ በጣም ድንቅ የሚባል እንደነነት አደረገለት ሁሉ ጊዜ ግን ፖሊስን ሲያይ በጣም ይፈራ ነበረ ምክንያቱም በህይወቱ ሙሉ ደግሞ ከፖሊስ ጋር ሲደበቅና ሲሮጥ ነበር አይኖረው in the wrong place they will give you a parking ticket Sweden ager lai degmo makina maqom yemaychal betsifra lai metachu makina ka qomachu yegetat horeqet yisetachual like a fine which you have to pay ስለዚ ያን የቀጣት ወረቀት ደግሞ መከፈል አለባችሁ ምናልባት 100 ዶላር ሊሆን ይችላል and this brother he didn't like when he got this parking tickets እንደዚህ አይነት የቀጣት ወረቀቶች ሲሰጡት ይሄ ወንድም በጣም ይበሳጭ ነበር and one day something happened in our office አንድ ቀን በቢሮአችን ውስጥ አንድ ነገር ሆነ the toilet which we have in the office በመስሪያ ቤታችን ውስጥ የምንጠቀምበት መጸዳጃ ቤት was not working anymore አልሰራ አለን every time we try to flush ሁሉ ጊዜ ውሃ ለመልቀቅ سنሞከር the water did not disappear ውሃው ወደ ታች አይወርድም we understood it is something blocking the water system ምናልባትም አንድ ነገር ውስጡ ተደፍኗል ብለን አሰበን so my brother who is the office director kazam wendme ye office ye masra betu director no he decided to clean up the water channel yannen mezeraja bet mazdat allebeñ tbon mazdat allebeñ bilo wesene it was not a nice job ya tru sira aidellem and when he did it neger gin siyadergo he found a lot of parking tickets bizu ye qitat worekatoch izaw us tetlo agenye from this brother ye wendem because this brother thought that if he put them into the toilet ምክንያቱም ያንን የቅጣት ወረቀት እዚ መጸዳጃ ቤት ውስጥ ከከተትኩት and try to flush them away ከዛም በኋላ እንዴት ካደረኩት they will disappear በቃ ይጻፋሉ ብሎ አስቦ ነበር but they did not disappear ነገር ግን አልጠፉ but they blocked the system ያንን የመጸዳጃ ቤት ስርዓቱን ሁሉ አቆሙት it had to be brought into the light ከዛም በኋላ ያ የተደበቀ ነገር ወደ ብርሃን ወጣ my brother said to me you cannot not flee the parking tickets kaza wandme hedo endezi yalo endet endezi tadergalle you have to pay makfelko allebe for your parking ticket lezi leqatat worekat makfel allebe but he did not have so much money neger gin bizu genzab alnebero my brother was very kind to him wandme gin betam degnet asayyo so he paid his tickets kaza yanen eqatat worekat kefelellet but i want to tell you neger gin and neger lingerachu we all have a very big depths of sin ሁላችንም ደግሞ የኃጢአት እዳ ነበረብን and we cannot pay our debts of sin ያንን የኃጢአት እዳ ደግሞ በራሳችን ልንከፍል አንችልም it's too expensive በጣም ውድ ነው you cannot pay your debts of sin የኃጢአት እዳችሁን ልትከፍሉ አትችሉም but you have a brother ነገር ግን ወንድም አላችሁ you have a brother who is a very wealthy brother ደግሞ በጣም ባለ ጠጋ የሆነ ወንድም አላችሁ his name is jesus christ ስሙም ኢየሱስ ይባላል he paid your ticket የእጣት ወረቀታችሁን ከፍሎላችኋል with his own precious blood ውድ በሆነው ደሙ hallelujah hallelujah and he say to you ከዛም እንደዚህ አላችሁ i have already paid your debt እዳችሁን ከፈልኩላችሁ but you only need to bring your sins into the light ነገር ግን መጀመሪያ ኃጢያታችሁን ወደ ብርሃኑ አምጡ confess your sins ኃጢያታችሁን ተናዘዙ and you are forgiven ከዛም ይቅርት ባላላችሁ because of the blood of jesus christ ከኢየሱስ ደም የተነሳ hallelujah hallelujah praise be to the living god ህያው ለሆነ እግዚአብሔር ምስጋና ይሁን that is power power when the working power በጣም ኃያል ኃያል የሆነ ኃይል ነው in the blood of the lamb የበጉ ደም hallelujah hallelujah you can be saved today ዛሬ ልትድኑት ይችላልላችሁ you can be born again today ዛሬ ዳግም ልትወለዱት ይችላልላችሁ today is your day of a miracle ዛሬ የታምራታችሁ ቀን ነው today is a new morning for you ዛሬ ለእናንተ አዲስ ማለዳ ነው hallelujah hallelujah praise be to the living god ያው ለሆነ እግዚአብሔር ምስጋና ይሆነ and then the bible says ከዛ መጽሐፍ ቅዱስ ሲናገር without faith ያለ እምነት it is impossible to please god እግዚአብሔር እንደስ ማሰኘት አይቻልም you see without blood ታውቃላችሁ ካለ ደም ስር የለም 
and without faith, you cannot please God. Oh, God is a faith God. You, you can never live a life so that you deserve His blessing. If you think that you can deserve them, it is not grace. But grace is undeserved favor. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. But without faith, it is impossible to please God. Some people came to Jesus and asked, what must we do to do the works of God? Jesus said, believe in God and in the one he has sent. It is faith, 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 faith all the time. Jesus said, if you have faith as a mustard seed, you can speak to this mountain. Be removed and it will be removed. You know a mustard seed is something very small. It's even smaller than this flower. This flower you can see. But mustard seed is much smaller. But you said, I thought I must have big faith. Uh, but Jesus said, if you have faith like mustard seed. So even if your faith is not big, who is the goal for your faith? What do you put your faith into? You can have big faith in yourself. And not much thing happen. But if you have faith like a mustard seed. In Jesus Christ. Miracle will happen. Today I want you to activate your little faith. Invest that faith in Jesus. And there you connect with the greatest power source in the universe. As more you walk together with Jesus. As more you practice your faith, your faith will grow. There came one man to Jesus. He was a Roman centurion. He said to Jesus, I have a son at home, he is sick. But I don't deserve you coming under my roof. But he just say a word. And my son will be healed. You know, Jesus stopped. And he was amazed. And he said, not in the whole house of Israel. I found that big faith. And then he said to the man. Go. Hid. And the same moment he went, the sickness also went away. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You can activate your faith in Jesus today. You activate it, you release the miracle. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I was 16 years old. When I said yes to God, He put a call upon my life. I was 16 years old. When He told me that He will send me to the nations of the world. I was 16 years old. When He commanded me to go and preach the gospel. And at the age of 18 years old, 
I have now been preaching the gospel in more than 50 years to the nation of the world. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It's more than a golden jubilee. And I want to tell you. Never, never, during all these years, Jesus has failed me. I have seen sometimes while I have been preaching, people receive the word by faith. Being healed in the name of Jesus. A number of years ago, I was into Ukraine where the war with Russia is now. And a father came with a piece of a prayer cloth. He asked me to pray for the prayer cloth. Because his son had cancer and was in the hospital. And the coming weeks they were about to open up his body and operate it. But the father rushed up to the hospital and put the prayer cloth up on his body. But when the doctor opened up his body some days after, there were no more cancer tumor in the body. Hallelujah. Oh, God is a faith God. Amen. Amen. I know he's doing miracle here every week. And I know God is using our brother Darius in a wonderful way. And I have witnessed marvelous miracle in this place. I want to tell you today is another day of miracle. We don't live in yesterday, we live today. Today, God is stretching out His hand. And He's touching us today. Even you who are in a distance. He is touching you today. With His power. Jesus very often said to the sick people, those who just touched him, and they were healed, Jesus said to them, your faith, your faith has made you whole. You would think that Jesus should say, my faith, but Jesus said, your faith turn to your neighbor and say, your faith will release a miracle. Yes, 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 yes. God is using the rest in a wonderful way. But you have Jesus within you. The same Jesus who is in the rest. The same Jesus is also in you. Believe. 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 And you can release miracles in your life. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Never fail you. Praise be to the living God. By faith. Everything is possible. I want you to say. By faith. Everything. Is possible. Amen. Amen. But many times we believe God will do it tomorrow. Oh, if we only had been here last Sunday, it could have happened. But Jesus said, I am the resurrection and life. If you only believe, 
you will see the glory of God. How many will see the glory of God? If you only believe, you will see the glory of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I give some important Bible teaching here this morning. The third powerful point is holiness. We were talking about it yesterday. And it has been talking to me. Holiness. Our God is a holy God. And the Bible says without holiness, no one will see God. Even in the Sermon on the Mountain of Beatitudes, Jesus said, Only the clean hearted will see God. But holiness is a work in cooperation between you and God. You cannot do all the holiness yourself. Holiness means separated. You know you are sanctified by the blood of Jesus. You must understand that the blood of Jesus has already sanctified you. And in the New Testament, God is disciplining us by His grace. Because in the Old Testament, God was disciplining the people by the law. But the people could not fulfill the law. Instead, they became hypocrites. They wanted to look more holy than they were. And Jesus confronted them. But Jesus has fulfilled the law. He has fulfilled all the commandments which we were unable to do. Because of that, he has sanctified us and he has justified us. I am justified because of the blood of Jesus. And I'm sanctified by his blood. But still the Bible tells us that the grace of God teaches us to deny ungodliness and worldly lust. You know, we are born again. We are God's sons and daughters. We are a royal priesthood. We love the presence of Jesus. We are a new creation. We love to be so close to Jesus as possible. A spirit-filled Christian is a committed Christian. You want to come closer and closer and closer to Jesus. But the carnal Christian, you want to approach the world and wondering how close can I come to the world and still be a Christian. But when we are a God-fearing people, we don't have the desires of the world. But we have the desires of Jesus. We are holy because of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And the devil will not have a hold on you. And I tell you something. I know you have a hunger for God. 
ለእግዚአብሔር በጣም ተርባቸዋል you will not even come to this church if you didn't have a hunger for god ya rahab bainorachu noro wedezi betekristian enkwan attemetum nebere how shall you be able to live a victorious christian life indet now dil adragi ye christian hiwetin menor yemitichilut how shall you be able to live in his holiness indet bersu qiddisna menor istichilallachu there is only one solution and bicha meftihen yallew that is to be filled with the holy spirit منفس قدوس مملات بتشانو مفتيو it is the holy spirit منفس قدوس نو which come into your heart and into your mind ود لباچو نو ود ايمراچو يميمطاو which will give you divine dreams كزا ملكوتاو يهونه هلمن يمطالاچو the holy spirit from god كاغزابير يتلاكو منفس قدوس hallelujah hallelujah the cloud of the holy spirit is here يمنفس قدوس دگموم اير بزي سفرا الله right now اهون When I say these words it is like I have a vision Look in the ra'y tayenyal I see like a white cloud under the roof here Zi degmo katariyo betach nech libs indalle yitsemanyal Oh it is the holy spirit Manifest qiddus no The mighty Holy Spirit. Ha yalu manfes qiddus no. Are you hungry for the Holy Spirit? Manfes qiddus inte rabachu tal way. You want to be full of the Holy Spirit. Be manfes qiddus ma mola tfelgalachu way. You want to have his fire on your life. Be watachu lay isatun tfelgu talachu way. Stretch your hand to God. Ejo chachun kafadir go wede xabe. Ejo chachun kafadir go. I receive it. Ikabalallo beluski. I receive it. Ikabalallo. I receive it. Ikabalallo. It will upgrade ደግሞ ከፍ ያረጋቸዋል it will bring you from here to a new level ከታች ወደ አዲስ ደረጃ ያሻግራቸዋል are you ready for a new level la addis daraja tezagajachu way are you ready for a new dimension la addis menget tezagajtachu hal way are you ready tezagajtachu hal way are you ready now ahun tezagajtachu hal way you say to jesus la jesus indezi malet felgalachu fill me now ahun mulany belut blow on me with your holy spirit be manfes qiddus mulany belut oh let the holy spirit come down ahun be manfes qiddus mulanyachu the presence of the holy spirit ye manfes qiddus luna isemanyal ibara shagara la babara la mai ni olovo ya lamendo oh hallelujah 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 oh praise be to god ለእግዚአብሔር ምስጋና ይሆነ you can be an overcomer አሸናፊ መሆን ትችላላችሁ if there is any secret sins in your life በህይወታችሁ ላይ ሚስጥር አርጋችሁ ያዛችሁት ኃጢአት ቢኖር sexual immorality ምናልባት ዝሙት ሊሆን ይችላል greediness for money ምናልባት ደግሞ የገንዘብ ስግብግብነት ሊሆን ይችላል proudness and loving power for yourself ራሳችሁን ደግሞ ከመከየትኛው ነገር በላይ ሞደድ ሊሆን ይችላል and unforgiveness ይቀር አለ ማለት ሊሆን ይችላል god showed me that this is the four hindering for many people ብዙ ሰዎችን ወደ ኋላ የሚያስቀሩ ነገሮች እነዚህ አራት ናቸው ብሎ ይናል sexual immorality zmut greediness for money ስለ ገንዘብ ስግብግብነት proudness in our heart ደግሞ ምን ቢት but he also showed me ደግሞ አሳየኝ unforgiveness ይቀር አለማድረግ there are many people ብዙ ሰዎች አሉ who never come into spiritual freedom በመንፈሳቸው ነፃነትን አይቀበሉም because they are full of bitterness ምክንያቱም በውስጣቸው ብዙ ምሬት አለ they are full of jealousy ብዙ ቅንአት አለ but right now ነገር ግን አሁን we will lay our burdens down to jesus ሸክማችንን ሁሉ በኢየሱስ ላይ መተን እንጥላለን right now አሁን you can do it symbolically all over this hall ይሄንን በመሳሌ ልታደርጉት ትችላላችሁ you say to jesus le yesus indezi belut here i come jesus yesus hoy metichallo here i come with my sins bahatiyate metichallo here i come with my failure ከውድ ቀቴ ጋር መጥቻለሁ I put it down at the cross ደግሞ በመስቀል ፊት አደርጋለሁ Forgive me ይቅር በለኝ You can bow you down where you are standing right now like this እንደዚህ መንበርከክ ትችላላችሁ I lay it down at your feet Jesus Christ በእግሮቹ ስር ኃጢያቴን ሁሉ ጥላለሁ ኢየሱስ ሆይ በሉ Hallelujah Hallelujah And he will say ከዛም እንደዚህ ላቸዋል My daughter ልጄ My son ልጄ ወንድ ልጄ ሴት ልጄ 
ሀዲያቶቻችሁ ሁሉ ተሰርዘዋል ሃሌሉያ አንድ አይ ሂል ዮ ሲክ ቦዲ ከዛ መታመመ ሰውነታችሁን እፈውሳለሁ አይ ሂል ዮ ሲክ ቦዲ የታመመ ሰውነታችሁን እፈውሳለሁ ነጻወጣችኋለሁ አንድ ኢፍ ዩ ሄቭ አኒ አንፎርጊቭነስ ኢን ዮር ሃርት በልባችሁ ደግሞ ይቅራ ያደርጋችሁለት ሰው ካለ Some people have done very bad things to you አንድ አንድ ሰዎች በጣም መጥፎ ነገር አድርገውባችሁ ሊሆን ይችላል Right now you say to Jesus ነገር ግን አሁን ለኢየሱስ እንደዚህ በሉት Father አባት ሆይ As you have forgiven me እነን ይቅር እንዳልከኝ I forgive my trespasses እኔ ደግሞ መተላለፍ ያረጉብኝን ይቀርራለሁ In Jesus name በኢየሱስ ስም Hallelujah Hallelujah በየጊዜው የምንለቃቸውን ቪዲዮችና የተለያዩ መረጃዎችን ለመከታተል ፕሮፌት ደረሰላቀው ህዝባር አንዊንቲንግ ቲቪ የሚለውን የፌስቡክ ገጻችንን ላይክና ፎሎ ያደርጉ። እንዲሁም ፕሮፌት ደረሰላቀው ህዝባር አንዊንቲንግ ቲቪ ወርልድ ዋይድ የሚለውን የዩቲዩብ ቻናላችንን ሰብስክራይብ ያደርጉ። በየጊዜው የምንለቃቸውን የተለያዩ ቪዲዮች በሰዓቱ ቀን ምን ይደርሱት ደግሞ የዶሮ መልእክቱን ይጫኑ።